Good afternoon, captains. As y'all can see, I am on my Jemadar Bridge. And, you know, today we're going to be um, briefly running across my bridge and then start our next mission is Armistice. But before I go ahead and do that, let me rearrange some of my powers and stuff and uh, I want to do this off screen I do apologize right now I'll put my heels Okay. Have that there. There's one I lost is what was that? Um Okay. Okay, now I got the way I want to set up. Okay. Let's see. This is Library Contact Duty Officers. Operation Counselor. Okay. Uh huh. Very purple. I've heard some people. While I read in comments and stuff, I'll go in there in a second. Let's see what's over here. Um, tactical turbo lift to lower deck. Okay, I'll go that in a second. That all this purple reminds me of Prince's Purple Rain. Select a small craft. Okay. Account bank and nothing. Yeah, but you know. Okay, this is the lower decks. Okay, sorry, my chair started slipping from underneath me for some odd reason. Ambassador. Right, go on here. Bartender, chef. Can't go in here. Doctor, scientist. Okay. 
engineer. Upper deck. Back in here. Well, that was actually quite a run through for the ship. Not bad, though. Okay. Let's get our orders. For Armistice. I need your help with a very sensitive mission. A former Kai, Opaka, was trapped on a prison moon in the Gamma Quadrant in 2369. Alien nanotech in her system prevents her from leaving the moon, but it also sustains her life indefinitely while on the surface. It seems the wardens of the prison were planning on curing and granting amnesty to the prisoners until their planet was decimated by the Herc. Somehow, the Dominion managed to obtain the cure, and they provided it to us as a peace offering. The moon hasn't been hit by the Herc, but it's only a matter of time. We need to cure Opaka and the others and get them out of there before that happens. Okay. Let's see, you get exp experience, expertise. Mm, prisoner outfit, prisoner outfit, cast light white. Well, since this is new, I'll probably get this for this mission. So, something else on your mind? I'm just gonna go ahead and oh, can I transfer from this location? Okay, let me get back to the bridge. Okay. Where do we go for that? You know what? Let's actually take It's called Ort System. Let's see where does it go. I really don't know where this is at. You know what? Let me see. I think it might be in the Gamma. I'm not sure. I think that's what they said. Maybe I overheard it. Yep, it is in a gamma. Planetary assault, sinister gala. Okay. So this is here. So say So I took that here. Armhole New Bayjour. Hmm, I have a feeling you think we're making some more missions for all this gamma quadrant and ain't going to just have a whole quadrant just for six missions let's see looks like I picked up something new this is new the energy ciphering Okay. 
Okay. Oh yeah, let me... We're doing that, I get... Mm, not skills, yeah that's it. Specializations. Forgot I got three specializations. See, I forgot which one was my second one. But that's right, I want this one as primary and command as secondary. I think that's how it was, I don't remember. Okay. Let's begin. Good, we've arrived. I suggest scanning the prison moon and its satellite network. They might have fixed the design flaw we exploited here years ago to bypass their defenses. Those satellites could cripple a Starfleet runabout with one shot back then. I'd rather not find out how powerful they are now, if you don't mind. Should Oops. be able to distract the satellites by firing. Pr Looks like the satellite weapon and defense systems were updated to deal with modern vessels, but they still have the same flaw that Mars O'Brien took advantage of years ago. You should be able to distract the satellites by firing probes near their position. Distract enough of them, and you'll clear an area long enough to safely beam down an away team. Picking up some debris clouds from Herc ships in orbit. Wow. It's possible some Herc bypassed the satellites. We should be ready. Looks like O'Brien's trick still works. The satellites took the bait and we have a safe transport window. Okay. We're in position. I recommend we bring some pattern enhancers along. Local interference can make it tough to get a lock on and we might have to leave in a hurry. All right, the doctor and I are ready to beam down when you are. Though I can't say I'm thrilled to see that moon again. Ah, the wreckage of the Yangtze Jang. Or what's left of her, rather. Looks like the locals have scavenged everything of value from the old girl. Unlike her, they can never die, thanks to the nanotech inside of them. Right. The last time we were here, the prisoners were eager to be cured, if only to get the chance to kill their rivals off for good. 
I'm hoping that Opaka has shown them a better path in the time she's been here among them. Okay. That. Got it. We're not alone. Herc life signs dead ahead. I just ran a medical scan on these Herc. They're not regenerated. There's no sign of the alien nanites in their bodies. Something in the Herc genetic makeup is incompatible with the nanites. I suspect it only works on humanoids. Okay. Wow. That was different. Okay. Okay. I think you'll find that she'll be in good health within moments. The healing nanites are quite effective. In fact, they seem to have become more efficient than they were last time I was here. You can relax. I'm fine now. Really. You made it. Good. The guy's been expecting you. Yes. She's had a vision about you coming here. Come with us. We'll take you to her. Unless you'd rather stand around here until more of those things show up. The guy's waiting for you, in the temple ahead. Welcome. It's been some time since we've had peaceful visitors. And Kai Kira. It's been too long. Truly, 
The prophets have smiled upon us today. Indeed they have. We have brought the cure. You'll be able to live a normal life away from here. You'll be free. And we have something to bring with us. A miracle. Is... Is that... Yes. A blessing from the prophets. The Orb of Peace. Through it, we ended the war between Ennis and Noel Ennis. As you can see, our peace has been shattered by the arrival of the hostile aliens. We have tried to speak with them, to find reason, but we have failed. We don't even know their name. They're called Herc, and there's no reasoning with them. They attack and devastate every world, every species they encounter. We need to get you and your people out of here as soon as possible. I see. We must take the orb with us as well. I can't have it falling into the hands of such a warlike species. It would be like the occupation all over again. That's not going to happen. I won't allow it and neither will my friends. We can administer the cure to everyone in groups. With your permission, we'll start right away. Very well. Begin the procedure. I'm sure many of us are eager to leave this place and begin a new life together. Okay. Some time ago, I asked Bashir for this cure. I wanted to use the cure as a weapon and kill the enemy. I couldn't put the war with the Knoll behind me. I hated him for denying my chance for vengeance. Now, that's changed, thanks to the Kai. I found a better path. I just want to lead a simple, natural life. Okay. Still not sure what type of cure, but... After all this time, to live a normal life. It's like waking up from a really bad dream. I, I can think about having a family again. An actual family. I don't know what else to say except thank you. Hmm. I don't remember the cure, what got them sick or what, but... The cure, huh? Well, this cure had better work, friend. Or we won't be friends no more. Get me. Okay. Then it's true what the Kai saw in her dreams, those visions. The Prophet sent us the orb, and now they sent you with our deliverance from this horrible place. Truly, the Prophet smile upon us all. Is this for real? This cure? They talked about it a little after the Kai arrived, but I thought it was a myth. Never thought it was actually real. So, I can die now. Funny, I never thought I would. And now that I can, I'm a little scared. Is that strange? When they put me here, all I knew was war. I don't remember why it started, just that there was us and the Ennis, and the Ennis had to die. Even when the Kai came, I didn't believe. But when they found the orb and people stopped killing, things changed for me. Eh, guess there's something to faith after all. Anyway, thanks for everything. Looks like you're down to one dose of the cure. Use that to inoculate the Kai. Kai or Parker, that is. I'll administer the cure to the rest here. Okay. 
I think I know what they're talking about. It's been so long since I saw Deep Space Nine or DS9. But. You have my thanks for all you have done for us today. May the blessings of the prophets be yours. Those things are attacking! Defend yourselves! I'm afraid he's dead. There's nothing we can do for him. Though we will mourn the loss of our friend, Gollum, we can take comfort knowing that, at long last, he was able to leave this place for a better one. He is finally at peace, and his pop will join the prophets in the Celestial Temple. The doctor and I will stay with Opaka and her people in case the Herc make another attack here. Once you've cleared the way to the transport site, we'll join up with you there. Okay. No, where we go? Guess I assume this way we go. out in one piece. Set up the pattern enhancer so we can beam out safely. There's no telling when the Herc will send reinforcements down. Okay, so where are you? Okay, there's one. Two. Three. We beam up. Mm, 
just so you can maybe give us more time to be able to reprogram on our side. Let's move the ship behind the satellites and move the hurricane. Recruit, provide an update on your progress. What happened on Alt? The Ennis and Null Ennis can finally die? I suppose in our own way, we too wish for death. It is our greatest proof of loyalty. Strange. They were immortal like the Founders, but chose to give it up. Perhaps an eternity of war made them weary of never-ending life. Of course. But perhaps life is other things as well. No matter. Your efforts on Ult will have a positive impact on the Federation. The rescue of a Bajoran spiritual leader is the kind of inspiration that warfare cannot provide. Just in time, here they come. This is hard. Well, it looks like the Herc have had enough for now. Let's get the rest of Opaka's people out of the colony while we can. 
The Herc might send a larger force to finish us off. I'm... Oh! <clears throat> I'll try and get the items and the next thing I completed it out. Emissary, our paths meet again. Hello, Ben. It's good to hear from you. Okay, that's different. Okay, let me see what they said to NPCs. Before I complete it out. I'm glad we were able to return Opaka to Bajor safely. She's determined to follow the will of the prophets and establish a new place of worship in the Gamma Quadrant near the Wormhole. Odo assures me that the Dominion are open to discussing this. See, many of us have not forgotten the fate of the new Bajor colony and the Dominion's role in that. As for me, my time as God is coming to me. I intend to guard the Celestial Temple from the Herc and anyone else who may destroy the Holy Prophets. Best place to do that is Deep Space Nine, as part of Starfleet. I'll be Captain Kira the next time you see me. Thank you again for helping me bring Apaka home. I owe you one. Okay, I'm just gonna get this. Congratulations on the first. Well, I already shot up to 65 already. The okay, let me. Okay. Let me see before I end up trying to get the items and everything. Let's see. I'm glad that I was able to minister to cure many prisoners. Okay. I say it's safe to board mortal for us. Years is this. Some of things I have, especially the ones. Wow, that was actually good. Okay, let me see what all happened. Okay, got that. Got that. So I received special requisition gamma. Duty officers, so I'll take my duty officers. Ah, oh, got me a gamma triple. Yeah. Okay, and what else? Okay, 65 is unlocked and that. So let me see what I get for 65. I'm going to go with Gamma Mox. Other uh, stuff because I do need. Nothing else there. Second mission. More gamma marks. Okay. Good, good, good. Okay. Inventory. So I know stuff I'm keeping is this. This. This is going to salvage. I know. Sorry about that, folks. Um, but this was different not what I thought on this mission but it was quite interesting um but I'm going to say I did enjoy it it was, seems like it seems like the Herc is much easier to kill on ground than in space but it takes a little bit more effort in space but you know if I had a more up to date ship well I mean not up to date but it's all ep uh, all been epic out to mark 15 gold and have it built out a little bit better 
I probably would have I'll be playing all this stuff on an elite version and I think it would be a much better fight but anyway folks thank you for watching and like always live long and prosper and victory is life